Hi there, it's Rick again from the Cat Jewelry School. Look, a few people have asked about this uh, question with regards to the channel tool, and I'd just sort of be quick to explain it in a few minutes in this video. So let's come to our jewelry tab and run a ring gauge. I'm using UK size N and a half. You might be in a different region, so use something appropriate. and we'll come to the channel tool I'll just switch over to shaded display here now remember we need to change and flip this channel around so we come here to do that let's type in 9-0 and rotate that and now we'll come to the gem and cut tab now the question people have been asking is uh, in earlier versions of Rhino Gold, you could actually change this and increment the number of stones. Now by default, uh, if you change stone size, what the rule is that it's it's trying to um, keep as small a gap between the stones as possible, which is really what you want. Uh, so as you increase the stone size, the quantity of stones is actually changing. I know it's not updating here, but it is actually changing the quantity of stones in your channel there. Now, if you do want to override that, you can do that, and you can come and click here, and now you can actually change and adjust the quantity of stones manually. So you can set a specific quantity of stones if you've got a specific quantity of stones of a certain size, for instance. You, know, you can set that manually rather than having the tool do that. Uh, personally, I never do that, not, not anymore. I, I have this set on and I set my stone size and obviously once I adjust the position of my stone relative to the channel if I change this cutter position let's say 0.45 it works out what quantity of stones I need and it works out the spacing there for me you can override the default spacing and change that to 0 0.1, 0 0.2 etc and again it will work out the quantity of stones it requires based on that spacing so yeah I do leave that setting on if you do want to disable that you can just click here and it will allow you to manually come in and adjust the stone quantity okay I hope that helps thanks